Well, the climbing wall is a great metaphor for how we learn at Havern because it's small steps. They're small steps and then sometimes they're great leaps. Havern Center is a small private school for children with learning disabilities. We have children who are dyslexic, dysgraphic, children who have processing disorders, both visual and auditorily. Some of the kids have um, problems with gross and fine motor skills. I don't think any kid comes to Havern without their families having been through tremendous struggles in kind of finding the right place. Every student learns at a different rate and a different um, way. So we do a lot of individualized programs for our students. We're one staff member for every four children. You come here and you think, this is what school should be like for everybody. Classes are small, the staff is committed, there's art, there's music, there's computers, there's uh, you know everything that you need. There's speech and occupational therapy to make it a successful place to learn. The children here at Havern are bright. Um, they learn a different way than the typical school is able to teach them. So Havern is able to adjust its curriculum to suit the child and then to bring the child's skills up. The Havern faculty is a group of very committed and dedicated teachers. Um, they spend a great deal of time here. They spend a great deal of time learning how to best serve and educate our students with their special needs. Denver is um, fortunate to have a school like Havern for parents to consider. Uh, we have looked at other major cities, the Northeast, Midwest, and the South, and not every cosmopolitan area has an option like this available to them. Havern is really a school and it is a place for kids who might otherwise just get by. And this is a place that really helps them fulfill their potential and to know that they can learn and that they can do. You know, I think that we've seen a lot of academic progress, which obviously is important because it's a school and that's, that's what you're here for. But I think the thing that has been equally valuable to us is that we can tell that he feels so much better about himself. He has a confidence, he um, recognizes things that he's good at and he's proud of that and um, he has good relationships with his peers. It's fun to, fun to watch him make these, you know, these giant leaps forward. And, and that's the, you know, I, and I just, I absolutely love it when, when a child does something that, aha, they've never done that before. Sometimes the success stories are as small as watching a student ride a bike or learn to read or write a paragraph. Um, for other students, it's something much larger, um, entrance into the high school they always wanted to go to. And the ultimate success is usually around graduation when we get high school graduation announcements, college announcements, and we hear about the wonderful lives our students are leading.